major news on the Cleveland Indians. They were willing to just, uh, discuss trading Francisco Lindor ahead of the trade deadline. Uh, it will be a high price. Their teams in the league that believe the Dodgers will be the favorites to land him. And Dora wants to be paid in the same range as Mookie Betts, as Mookie Betts' is $365 million extension, which is why the Indians want to trade him, according to the rumors. He's having a down, down standard, a down season, having a 7.64 OPS, slightly above the league average. He averaged 34 home runs all this year. That's pretty good. They'll free agency 2022. More Indians news. Michael Clevenger, Dodgers, Yankees, uh, White Sox. I understand the White Sox are trained. Want to trade the whole thing for him. He said the score covered it. San Diego Padres. I'm pretty happy with that. Trade Zach Davies, someone from Atlanta Braves. He and Zach Plazic violated COVID-19 safety protocols. So I guess that could be a problem for the team. Chris Paddock and Garrett Richards have struggled. They would really benefit getting trades. The Indians would love to have those two on the team. Phenomenal pitchers. Don Braves just got time blown, but need a lot more s s starters considering all the, all the starting injuries and they had that rough start in the game in general. Clevenger is also, uh, I'll talk about Hater later. The Yankee, oh, the Dodgers are interested in the Hater in addition. Uh, Price is high. He remains under team control and arbitration through 2023. The White Sox want to send Adam Engel in addition to pitching prospect Michael Kopech possibly. I still endured trading price seems high and it seems like a long shot even though it would cost a lot of money to get traded. Michael Kopech is a very good prospect. Uh, would do phenomenal with the Indians. Not that great so far, but hopefully it will do better. He opted out of the season. So, the long term, uh, Indians have a lot of hitting now with uh, Ben Rays and all those other players. Not sure if they're still doing good this season. I haven't really watched them. Hopefully, we'll see. What are your thoughts on the subscribe?